Hello everybody, my name is Avisa K, and welcome to the game Cozy. Now, I don't know anything about this game, but I do know that I just now started it up, and um, it's a point-and-click adventure game, and if you've ever were in the highlight of kind of the web-based games, like a browser-based, and that is also very, very loud. I don't know if you guys can hear it at the same volume I can, but it's like blaring. Anyway, um, in the kind of the web-based browser games, there were a lot of click-and-point adventure style games, and that kind of genre still resonates with me deeply because it was a big genre at the time. I played a lot of games. Uh, hardly feels necessary in a forest, so um, we just kind of, the point is to just kind of click around and see what we need to do. I just need to make sure my uncle's okay, then I can leave. So we're looking for our uncle, who seems to be in danger. So let's move. Okay, that puts him back in the car. What do I have in my rucksack? Nothing. Okay. Uh, I guess we just venture forth. The wind is bitter and cold, as it should be. Much too thick to walk through. Would make a nice warm fire. It's a lot of big trees. Uncle's cottage, but the lights are out. Then why does your uncle live all the way out here? Why don't you just, like, why does he not have a road? Fat, fake rock. Fat rock, there's something under it. I'm guessing a key? Yes, that's a spare key. It's always under the rock. And, you know, they think they would make something else because every burglar would know where the key's at since it's always under a rock. I like your choice of decorations. Not my kind of art. What's wrong with it? I mean, it's just a dead guy, right? Random little door there. I like, like, that is very undulating like 3d graphic it's weird it's like the sprite for it is you got a little bit of a draft here uncle oh yeah i see you boarded it up old moldy pillow nothing else are you sure your uncle's still alive i think he's very dead a radical yet classical appreciate wait approach to the rectangle i can't really tell what that is Swedish side table, only nine dollars or ten in the USA. Yeah. He's dead. I knew it. Can't reach it. The boards are blocking the way. Can we leave? How did you not know your uncle was dead? Kettle, good for boiling water. It is, not really hungry right now. I'm always hungry. Who is not always hungry? Full of electricity. In this location, I doubt it. Toaster's plugged in. Empty glass, too bad there isn't anything to drink. No water will come out, pipes must be frozen. Okay. See, a lot of these have to do with, um, that looks just like my uncle. One about to stay in there. All right, so I have um, a glass, and I'm suspecting I can fill this with snow. Snow is too packed tight to put the glass in. I wasn't going to do that. I was just going to fill the glass up with snow. That way I could melt it. Oh. Pile of loose snow interred with the remains of a snowman. Who built it? Your uncle's dead. Door's frozen shut. See, I need... Wait, maybe I can get it from the snowman. Maybe let me do that. Um, I need snow. Yeah, okay. I need the snow in the glass so I can then melt the snow on the fire. I'd burn my hands before the snow melts. So I can then melt... Melt it. Okay, now I have warm water. Now I can take this out to the shed and unfreeze that thing. 
There we go. Alright, what is this? Slider flow guarantee ignite almost anything. I uh, need the hammer. Blue plastic shovel looks cheap. Probably is. It's getting dark. I should leave. What do I need the hammer for, though? What happened to the snowman? What about my uncle? It's gonna... It's gonna... It's shovel broke. At least the snow is gone. What? The door is now bashed in? I need to pry it open. Just run of the mill stick. Pry it open with the stick? Stick is not sturdy enough. Maybe the hammer. I should have used the hammer in the first place. This already has plenty of dents in it. You said pry it open. Let's go find something else. Oh, I have to go back inside. See, there is a certain kind of um, feeling that these games can give off that is very creepy, and it it catches you sometimes. I don't even know what I'm looking at here. Wait, wait, wait. Boards are blocking the way, so maybe if I use the hammer... Why won't it work? They're boards. I have a hammer. I can pull the nails. From the outside. So, maybe I have to... Go outside to get inside? fluid, guaranteed not almost anything, whatever, whatever, whatever. I'm pretty sure I've seen something up there earlier. Do we have to go back downstairs? I don't like it down here. I'm not really sure what I'm looking for. Hmm. See, I want to, um... Also, we're ready to see outside. The pipe's frozen. The toaster's plugged in. That works just fine. What do I use the stick for? You're not going to let get electrocuted from a stick. I'm telling you that now. I can't use this from this side because it won't work like that. I, I, my hand don't move that way. I gotta be missing something. See, a lot of times these games require uh, a lot of the time a lot of uh, mental work. Like they're not just you know go with the flow games. You gotta think your way through it, and that kind of makes you more involved in the game. And it works very well with storytelling, which is what made these games awesome. It won't work. Okay, let's try... Maybe going back to the car. Was there anything else here? I need to try to pry the door open, but I have a stick, and a stick won't work. <sighs> Can I put the stick in the snowman suit? No, okay. Hammer, no, that, no, that won't work. Why can't I pick up the lighter fluid? That seems like something I should be able to do. Do I need to use the stick to reach it? It'll just pour off. Something needs to absorb it. Okay, what if... So I need... I'm going to make a torch with this, is what it's telling me. So I need some... Um... Fabric. Maybe the rug? No. Wait, the moldy pillow! Uh, it'll probably give me like some kind of nasty disease, but... Okay, hang on. Let's try to back out and use this on the pillow. 
Seriously, there's nothing but this damp old pillow. Sheets are damp. I'd rather not know with what. So I can't use those. Okay. Alright. Is there anything else I could use? I don't know if there's any other fabric around. And it's too dark for me to see down there. No. I gotta find something to make a torch with. Snow wouldn't work, obviously. Uh, and I'm guessing I have to use the um, toaster to ignite it. Doors and bashing, need to try to pry it open. Something or someone attacked my car. Okay, well, I need to get in because you may have something I can use. It already has plenty of dents. You know what, buddy? What if I use the painting? Moldy pillow was like the best idea I had, and it don't even work. Sheets are damp. I don't know what width. They're too damp to use the pillow on. Or to use with this, apparently. I have nothing to use in here, I don't think. No, of course not. See anything around here? Not hungry. Of course, you're not hungry. There's a different pattern on the floor. Okay, hang on, guys. I'll be back whenever I figure out what I need to do. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. Um, I'm not sure why it decided to let me do that now. I'm not sure why it let me decide, like. Why did it let me do that now? But it did, so. Uh, we've got extra absorbent, make good wrapping. I'll put that on the stick to make a torch. Antipsychotics, anti don't take a medication. Snip, snip, there goes your fingertip. Okay. E. Oh, those, no, those. Okay. <gasps> oh, Jesus. That's like the cheapest jump scare ever. Okay, I need to set this on fire, but I'm gonna have to go out and get the lighter fluid. Just uh, important. Okay, I have to put this on this. That's sticking lighter fluid. Now I can light it because before, when I tried to light it, um, that was when I cut. You guys didn't see it. Uh, it the stick wouldn't stay lit. So. Okay, I can finally see. So there's a crowbar here. Plastic broomstick broken in half. What is this? Full of odds and ends, nothing particular to use. But I can now use this to prime my car open. Yeah, okay, here we go. Finally, I get in my car now. What's going on? My keys are missing. I have to find my keys. Well, what'd you do with them? Really? Did the uh, man, old man, swindle me out of my keys? Nothing down here. Nothing in my book book bag. Where are my keys? I bet the old man swiggity swooty stole my keys from a booty. I bet that's what he did. I'm gonna walk in there, he's gonna kill me. I don't quite there it is. Where are my keys, old man? You gonna jump scare me again? Wait. No, he didn't. He's not there anymore. 
he's not. I can't. All right, so where the heck are my keys? Okay. Get the heck out of here! He's probably waiting on me in my car. That was, a, that was a pretty good game. Um, like I said, you know, the games like that, they suffer graphical-wise. But I, in my opinion, it's not the wind noise, Jorgo. That's really cool. Um, but like I said, you know, a lot of the uh, web-based games uh, do tend to have fewer graphic like comparison, obviously. But their storytelling and all that is um, above a lot of other games. And they use their storytelling to... Uh, really get you into the game and they also use um, mind like you have to be thinking and I think my webcam just shut off okay sorry about that um, yeah they use a lot of um, forward thinking that you have to use your mind to really get through the game it's not going to tell you through gameplay or anything else and it, you know um, that one was kind of uh, short but it was good it was a really good game and uh credit to the developer is very nice uh very good story unsure why we were there in the first place but you know for a like 10 minute game not too bad not too bad i enjoyed it it was very good so thank you all so much for watching i will see you in the next one bye bye